Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am sharing one of my mom's recipe called Masala Fried Rice. This is not like the typical Indo-Chinese one which we usually prepare, but more like Desi style. So let's begin. The main ingredient in this fried rice is potato. So make sure you don't skip on it. I have taken few carrots, spring onions and two green chilies. Due to lockdown, I haven't got French beans here, but I'm going to use frozen green peas later. I'm pre-prepping with all the ingredients beforehand as it's easy to stir fry them later. I'm using a food processor here to finely chop the potatoes. Heat a wok on high flame and add some oil. Once the oil is hot, add quarter teaspoon of salt as it prevents the potatoes getting stuck at the bottom of the pan. Now add finely chopped potatoes and fry them until they are crispy. The potatoes are nice and crispy here. Now I am going to add little black pepper powder and set them aside on a plate. Now let's prepare the masala for the fried rice. In a pestle and mortar, Add around half a teaspoon to one teaspoon of whole peppercorns and crush them. Then add few cloves of garlic. Here I have taken four cloves of garlic but you can reduce it if you don't like the strong flavor of garlic. Once the garlic is nicely crushed, add a small piece of star anise and a cinnamon stick, cloves and one cardamom and crush them all together. I am taking the same wok here and adding little oil to it. Now I am adding whole spices. Add 1 star anise, 1 inch cinnamon stick, 3 cloves, 3 cardamom pods. I like to open the cardamom pods as it releases more flavor. Saute for a couple of seconds and then add 2 slit green chilies. Once the green chilies are nicely fried, add finely chopped carrots. Fry them on high heat for a couple of minutes. Now I'm adding frozen green peas. If you got fresh peas, you have to boil them beforehand and then add it to the fried rice. And finally add spring onions. I usually like more vegetables in my fried rice so I have taken slightly more vegetables. But you can always adjust according to your preference. Once the vegetables are nicely cooked, make a little space in the middle of the pan and add a little oil. Then add the crushed garlic. Make sure you don't burn the garlic while frying it. Add a teaspoon of salt, little black pepper powder and the pan fried potatoes. Here I have cooked 1 cup of basmati rice in rice cooker. I have a video already on my channel on how to cook rice perfectly in a rice cooker. I'll leave the link in the description box down below. The tip here to use freshly cooked hot rice to make a fluffy fried rice is to make sure to turn off the flame before you add the rice. This way the residue heat which is present in the pan as well as the rice helps in cooking the fried rice perfectly without turning the rice mushy. Be a little careful while mixing the rice as it is hot it might break easily. The delicious masala fried rice is already here. Please do try it and you will definitely love this especially when you get the crispy potato bits in between. You can serve this fried rice with ketchup or chili garlic sauce but my mom usually serves it with raita. So I'm going to quickly share the recipe for raita. I'm taking the same food processor which I used to chop the vegetables earlier. I'm taking a handful of mint and coriander leaves, one deseeded tomato, 
half an onion and one inch of cucumber and I'm chopping them finely. To a bowl, add curd or the plain yogurt which is naturally set. Make sure you don't use any flavored ones for this. I added around 4 to 5 spoons. Mix until it's nice and creamy. Then add the chopped onion, tomato, cucumber and mix well. Season the raita by adding half a teaspoon of salt. The cool refreshing raita along with the masala fried rice is an amazing combination to have. Please do try it out and let me know how you like it. I hope you liked today's video. If so, please like the video and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. See you all in another video. Until then, bye.